Another story we've been following all day for the second time in less than five weeks, a security breach at the Bear County Jail forcing that facility to go into lockdown. This time, a large hole on the second floor and an attempted escape from the inside. Dylan Collier live at the jail where Sheriff Javier Salazar wrapped up a press conference just about an hour ago. Dylan. Myra and Steve, two suspects held here since last fall, accused of using rebar and makeshift tools to burrow through a jail cell on the second floor. That hole, we're told, was not quite large enough for a human to fit through. It was found by a recently formed contraband abatement team while that team was walking around the outside of the jail around 8 this morning. This comes one month after three capital murder suspects were able to escape, escape from the jail. They got through a mesh netting in an exercise area, used a sheet to drop down to the ground, and then got away in a getaway car. They were on the run for less than two hours. Three other people were later charged in connection to that escape. A report from the Texas Commission on Jail Standards released yesterday revealed that officials here at the jail knew in January that contraband was being brought into the jail and that an escape plan was in the works. Despite all of this, Sheriff Javier Salazar says he has not lost confidence in his jail command staff. It's something that you're always you're always concerned with is is you know do you do you are you doing the right thing do you have the right the right folks on board at this point we haven't reached that point uh, but but you know it's certainly something that that is causing us to review not just policies and procedures but personnel as well. The two suspects in this escape attempt today identified as Martin Herrera and Ramon Medellin Jr. Herrera has been here since last fall on a human trafficking charge. Medellin has been held here for several months on a felony drug possession charge. Sheriff Salazar said it does not appear that they had help from the outside in this escape attempt. Uh, Herrera is considered the main person involved in this and that he may have dug on this hole for several months. Medellin accused of joining the efforts just last night around midnight. And again, this escape attempt was thwarted early this morning. They were not able to eventually get outside of the Bear County Jail. Live at the jail, Dylan Collier, KSAT 12 News.